the nutrients in the food gets absorbed into the blood vessels present in the villi of the small intestines now these undigested unabsorbed food gets transported from the small intestine to the large intestine and then it gets finally eliminated from the body now after food gets absorbed by the small intestine it enters into the blood flow the blood vessels carry this blood that has absorbed food into the various parts of the body now let us see what is happening inside the cell see inside the cell the food is getting digested into nitrogenous wastes like urea and this process is known as cellular digestion now urea formed during cellular digestion in the cells are very toxic to the body that is its presence can cause harm to the body so it needs to be excreted out of the body so waste products like urea that is formed in the cells are carried again via the blood vessels into a special organ present in the body via the heart this special organ that is present in our bodies are known as the kidneys kidneys are bean shaped organs that are present on the either side of the backbone see we have two kidneys in our body the primary function of the kidney is filtration it works just like a water filter it filters the blood and takes out all the impurities that are present in the blood like urea and gives out purified blood back to the body so this is the main function of the kidney so the kidney purifies the blood and takes out all the nitrogenous waste products such as urea and together with water which acts like a liquid medium so that it can flush out all the toxic products present in the body forms a liquid known as urine and this urine is then eliminated from our body